Hi, my name is Ankit, Ankit Singh Kushwa. I am from India. For the first two years, I find it very difficult uh, to get the job and get to know the system. After two years, I get, get along with things and I make some friends, Kiwi friend, they told me, and I get to learn a few things very quickly. And then uh, I've been all good since then, and I've been here for nine years. It's a long time, yeah. My name is Jack. I'm from uh, Tianjin, which is Italian China. Um, it's next to Beijing, has about 15 million people, so not a very big city. I'm here in New Zealand for about 16 years now, and I'm currently um, the owner and operator of uh, Hell Pizza Sydney. I came over here when I was 18 years old, and um, I was here to study, and um, just want to um, see the Western world as well. A uh, couple of years on, and I just um, decided I really like New Zealand, I like to call it home, and I'd, um, I just worked really hard to try to stay here, and here I am. When I moved to New Zealand, I moved with one of my really good friends from the same place where I'm from in India. And we moved here and after study he went back to India because he just don't want to study um, anymore and he was missing family and his girlfriend a lot. So he just moved back but I stay here. So yeah, there was one friend. Yes, I miss home for the first two, three years but then I get like um, my brother here. Uh, my younger brother, my wife is here, I got a daughter now, I got a lot of friends. So I don't miss that much anymore. But for, for the first two or three years when I was having a hard time with finding a job and getting get things settled, I was missing family a lot. But once I got settled, I don't miss that much. But I still miss, you know, time to time. <laughs> I basically moved here because it's uh, New Zealand is beautiful, it's got a lot of beaches, it's very peaceful, it's uh, very uh, remote um, basically and uh, less people in compared to India and when I got here I just like the environment, it's just like very chill here basically, the climate is very chill. I'm back um, home, New Zealand seems to be a um, quite popular option for a lot of um, students that want some OE, like overseas experience. Um, and it was quite easy to get a visa for as well. And um, I sort of decided on New Zealand first before I really get understand, um, get to know New Zealand a bit better. And the more I look into it, actually, the more I get attracted to it as well. So I think, um, yeah, looking back, it's a really good decision. I think New Zealand is my home country now. I haven't faced any racism in New Zealand, but uh, there has been some chances where there's like, some um, people just, you know, trying to be funny, you know, but it happened everywhere. So I, I don't think it's racism, you know, it's just like normal, you know. I do, uh, I, I mean, uh, I never watched rugby uh, before I come to New Zealand. I never understand or know anything about it, but um, since I come to New Zealand, I start to sort of embrace the culture and um, it's a good way to get to know people as well. Um, I, would, I would like to try different things, different lifestyles, because I used to work for a corporate company for about 10 years before I moved on to and um, um, bought this business with Eddie, my business partner. Um, the reason I want to do it is just because I want to try something different, not necessarily something better, but different from my old lifestyle. In the next few years, uh, when my daughter grown up a little bit, like she's like two months old right now, so after she grown up like two, three year old, then we gonna get a house, me and my wife. Gonna settle uh, in, uh, basically it would be in Christchurch somewhere in suburbs. Uh, settle down here for another 10, 15 years and just try to, you know, uh, live here and go to India and just live a chill, basically chill life, you know.